Hey there, I am with Michelle hey from Pine I and Navy, here and I am going to get Michelle to tell us a little bit about her dodo and leather Michelle. and dodo. So terms. hey, Michelle, and Hi. we're really excited to have them. Thanks here. for having me. And um, um, my I just want to get them to take a minute inter- and introduce Pine and Navy and their shop. Um, I started my okay. Etsy shop in Hi, 2017. Oh, okay. It was a um, makeup artist previously. Thanks for having and, us today. Um, so um, was really wanting we have two Etsy shops. Case, the first guess, one is called Dodo Leather. It's really drawn to um, making jewelry. And it's a shop and, where we sell um, our handmade leather goods. I actually all started with kind of things from little accessories jewelry, to big bags and backpacks. Somehow and the second shop <laughs> is called uh, Dodo Charm. Uh, that's so where we sell some sense. handmade. Um, you know, like what is it about Palmer Clay that draws you to it? Awesome. So uh, how did you get started with your shop? There's like endless possibilities. Well, um, it all started just so fun in 2012 to when we were still living yeah, in Ukraine, yeah, which is our native country. Yeah. So, so are, are you uh, we didn't with think of jewelry? anything like, like, I am, um, like Etsy or any really, craft really cool. business. We um, had you started in jobs. 2017. Can you tell us about a really great customer experience? And I was working in sales for some food distribution company. And There's been a it lot. all started like um, a fun, fun a craft project. We bought a couple markets, of uh, supplies to and we customers made me a pair of see their excitement. And and actually, when they wear it, too, from that we, we just started um, learning more and more. And I've also met people through my Etsy shop who live all across he, Canada. He, he suddenly and, um, decided he so was nice. Start when they send the reviews in, and take like send pictures or tag me on social media. The items in both your shops are absolutely stunning. There is a bag oh, that's that I awesome. Now you're from Prince Edward Island, so does being from Prince Edward Island make you want to move to Canada? Yeah, you're from Prince Edward Island. So does being from Prince Edward Island inspire you? So when did you guys absolutely totally does? I get my inspiration a lot from when did you start your shop? Your your nature and being in nature and hiking and you know from the shape of leaf to flowers. For all those different yeah, the shapes so kind of inspire we what I want to create next. Uh, craft awesome. business, so what's but your actually the Dodo Leather was started in 2013 and oh Dodo Charms in a year after. Oh, wow. Um, I think so. You're not professionally trained at all, you're completely self taught. Well, how nice yeah, and kind one another. That's, that's how it is. Yeah. He got Just his education as an architect, which how helped him a lot. Atlanta, Canada is, catching, and designing, the food like, is wonderful. Three dimensions <laughs> thinking. That's a good one. So <laughs> that's the thing he's really is good at. Is there another maker can, that inspires like, you? Look at the bag, and he would know oh, wow. how it's yeah. constructed. Oh, so he would look at some um, object, and he would. Like it's helped he would understand Probably how Kim to make it Happy at once. Like, so, is one of my uh, so I think he's like an architecture of, background uh, helps just her amazing a lot, but he didn't have and, any like professional um, leather training nor how inclusive because, and helpful like, she is. It even to didn't other exist. Makers we really didn't have any kind of school in Ukraine who would teach yeah, people lovely. leather or jewelry yes, making. Yeah. She's yeah. great. Um, what is your favorite thing about being a maker? Uh, three years. Oh it's gonna be three um, years to the end of August. My favorite things are probably okay, actually awesome. in the making. So, I love what, just tell me about studio, living in Atlanta, Canada. Things. What do you What do you like about it? What do you love about um, it? Create Creative outlet. Well, well, and the so second best thing things. is actually when I see people wear. Sincerely think like that this is just the best place to live to have a kid and that. That's so true though. Like it's it's crazy to see that. So um, we love it, people. We why love do you think it's so important here. that we support our local we, uh, Like as an immigrant, it was oh, wow. so important oh, for us to feel I think it's so important because to, uh, to feel like people are like accepting us with our it's so with important to support accent, our local our, artists some because cultural differences and it's kind of it like the heartbeat of our society and from the beginning, without it yeah, it's just and, kind of a bleak place um i love and how people react to our when we tell them our story yeah, it's and like a patchwork how they support so, much, us. so pretty when there's so many so pieces that's one put together that people are great more we vibrant we love that's being really great close to the ocean and now have a visual we don't go there as often i want to hear something really fun or interesting about you here it appeared to be mm-hmm. not as bad as being okay. um, well, my very so first job we thought like canada would be totally hard 
harsh I winter, nine months a year. It was. It is really nice. <laughs> that is so fun. Oh, I'm so happy to hear this. <laughs> that is like fine. That is like something you put differently. Like, being here. yeah, that would be like my uh, front and center project? on my Instagram bio. Like well, that's amazing. Uh, <laughs> Oh, no. You can Airbnb that now, like, I think. If I will speak about it, yeah, day, like yes, you could. Yeah. I don't think that. Um, all right, where can we find you outside. on social media? I think he's just I'm his mind is full uh, all the time to these ideas. And Perfect. We are gonna link those below. To, and like, thank you um, so much for taking the time. We're gonna visit you in your shop a little bit later today. Like, uh, um, but we'll see you soon. When he sees thank some you. nice material, some nice leather high. Hey there, I am with Michelle from and Pine and Navy, about and I am gonna get Michelle to tell us a little bit about herself and her shop. I think that life in Atlantic Canada. It Hi. allows us to become Thanks more calm. Thanks for having me. Um, my name is Michelle. Don't, don't be so much afraid and about creator, safety Pine and Navy. issues and things like um, that. I started my their, Etsy like, shop, shop in 2017. For example, we feel more it was a makeup for like artist but previously and um, sure, like, he was really and wanting he, kind of a change in I pace, was, I guess. Was, and yeah. I was really drawn to making jewelry. That's and, really interesting. Um, yeah. it, it's I actually really started out with hear that. making and fiber jewelry. And literally it somehow <laughs> transpired uh, it. into polymer clay. And that's what I've been Do doing it ever in, since. in a way that it doesn't. Um, what is it about polymer yeah, clay it, that draws you very cool to and it? Largely, it was um, because I think we had an empty shop. There's like was, endless uh, possibilities. The and we moving, it's we just so fun to shape and create. And, and yeah, one of our yeah, challenges was just endless to start production. Yeah. And so, are, are you self taught with as soon as your jewelry? After we like moved, I am. So, we kind of that's really, organized really everything. Cool. We rented um, the house. You started in 2017. Like, Can you tell us about a really great We ordered everything beforehand, like our furniture from IKEA. So, as soon as we there's came, been like a three lot. days after we received um, the furniture and the one week after we received the our markets, shipments where you actually like, get to meet and your customers face to face and we, and like a week after see their excitement the actually when they wear so, it and we started <laughs> yeah um, it was crazy because at the same time we had to met people like, through my Etsy all shop kind of documents all across had to buy a car and do all the things when they send the right reviews and take like sending pictures or tag me on social media we just extended Oh, that's awesome. Now you're from Prince Edward Island. So does being from Prince Edward Island inspire your work? Absolutely, yeah. totally we does. offered some discounts. Uh -huh. I get my inspiration a lot from we agreed to wait. Um, and nature and, and actually being in nature and hiking and, and, and you know, from the shape of a leaf to flowers. <laughs> All those that different shapes really, kind really of inspire incredible. what I want to like, create now. That's, that's a really, awesome. really So what's your cool favorite part about it? And I, I love that you, you just say, I, we didn't even oh miss gosh. a beat. You just ordered everything so Oh, neat. wow. Um, um, I think So what do you love the most and, about being a maker? Um, how nice and kind we are to one another. Um, and like uh, one of the just biggest Scene we like, how beautiful and of us like is, that, and that we are food is entrepreneurs. Uh, we work for <laughs> ourselves <laughs> and that we work together. Is there another so maker that inspires sometimes, you? <laughs> yeah, sometimes it's oh, not wow, easy yeah. to oh, stand so each other like um, 24 hours, but at the same time, like he's my best him partner him in life and yeah, business, yeah, and I hope I am the same for him. Uh, so yeah. uh, just for me with baby, which is also yeah. challenging but how feel like inclusive and helpful we can, she is um, to other yeah, makers so that's and really the, wants the, one of the things what we like and another thing like she's very lovely we, we're doing what yes. we love like <laughs> what, what we are passionate um, about what is your and, favorite thing about being a maker like he can sit oh, all gosh, day um, in his work just, studio my if favorite ever, things are probably <laughs> actually in the making and love just being in my studio he would be so happy just to sit and make something with his hands and create something and the second best thing is Actually, That's when I see people wear always was so patient and we do I just it's just like because I'm responsible to, for a lot of like business that, related things. That's I so true don't though. Like it's much like it's time to see when you see that. Thing, but I, um, I do I love it. <laughs> Why do you think it's so important yeah, that we support our local makers? It's really, really cool. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, I think it's so You're important. You're so inspiring. Because... Like, I'm just getting inspired listening to you and oh, just how goodness. you play off of each other. And, like, you can tell it's like, so you love it so much. Like, I just love to listen to 
you talk about oh us kind God. of like the heartbeat of our Can you guys tell me something really interesting about it, you guys kind of or as place. individuals? And Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's like, it's like uh, a patchwork okay. quilt. So um, it's so pretty when there's so many pieces put together and it, it makes it more uh, vibrant. So That's mm. a really great way to put it. I love that. I now have a visual of that. That's awesome. Okay. So I want to okay. hear something really so fun, fun or interesting so about you. He does fun or interesting about me. Okay. Uh, well, my very Mark first job at like, the university, wide, but very rare, but I work for like, Oscar Mayer Wiener, which is and very, very, very unusual Wiener. for Canada. a Ukrainian guy. And <laughs> that is so like fun. Stereotypes. <laughs> that is like, that is like something you put like, like beer yeah, that would be like my front and center on my Instagram bio. Like, that's amazing. Uh, you can Airbnb that now, I think. He likes mountain biking. Yeah. And yes, you could. Snowboarding. <laughs> he likes. Um. All right. Where can we find them? you on social yeah. media? And I'm at another fun and fact Navy about on him Instagram and Facebook. That, Perfect. We are going to link those below. Um, and thank you so much for taking the time. We're going to visit you in your shop a little bit later today. Uh, um, he's but he's we'll see you soon. me all day long. All day, yeah. And yeah. yeah. <laughs> he takes so much pleasure. Hey there. I am with Michelle so from Kind and, 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 and I am going to get yeah. Michelle to tell us a little bit about herself and her That's, job. And so, hey, he's Michelle. teaching our baby Hi. to do the same. He's Thanks for having me. My name is Michelle. I started um, my um, Etsy shop in 2017. I was a makeup um, artist previously and um, oh, you're dancing oh, yeah, was really I, wanting I do crazy kind of a change when I'm in pace, excited, I guess, I do crazy and I was really drawn to everywhere. making jewelry. No matter where and, we are, um, so, and this is very embarrassing I actually started for, me for some reason. Making I don't know why, but he's always trying to somehow transpired into polymer clay. And maybe and some and big bag. bag. Yeah, and, and, and um, and I, what is it about polymer clay that draws you and I, to I it? Start dancing and uh, just yeah, because and there's like oh, endless oh, possibilities. It's just so fun to shape and create. And yeah, yeah, there's just endless possibilities. Yeah. Well, there's so a are, quote are that says every time you buy from jewelry? an Etsy seller, there's like a real am, person on the yeah. other side that does that really, actual really cool. happy dance. Um, so you started so in true. 2017. Like, Can you tell us about a really great customer our experience you had? We even have a ritual uh, every oh, time yeah, yeah. we heard yeah, yeah. this. Um, uh, so there's been a lot. We kissed um, and hugged. It was a lot of having the Etsy market. We actually get to meet your customers face to face and see their excitement. Actually, when they wear it. Find you online on social media. Um, uh, and I've so also met people like, through my Etsy uh, shop all across Canada. And, shops, and, and um, we also so have nice to when they send their reviews in and, and tag, recently like, send started pictures or tag me on the social letter. media. And I'm still Keep learning it, which is it. very far. Oh, that's but awesome. Now, you're from I Prince Edward Island. So does being from Prince Edward Island We're going to link your your Instagram, your Facebook, and your TikTok. Um, After the okay. video, I get everyone to follow you and see your happy uh, dances, um, and then it'll encourage you to be in nature, and, nature if you and hiking, videos. and you know, from a yeah. shape Thanks of a leaf so to flowers. Thanks so much for chatting flowers, today. We're so excited to have you in the market, and we can find you in your shop. Next. All right, so what's your favorite Thank you. Yeah, we are very excited about the market. Oh, yeah.